Hello, I'm Melanie Stambaugh, and I'm proud to represent the 25th District here in the House of Representatives. Here I am at my desk on the House floor, the location of my first video update. Much has gone on these past several months, from sitting in the Education and Higher Education Committees, talking with many constituents from the 25th District, and having much deliberation on what bills I would vote for here at my desk. I am glad to share that my House Bill 1554 this week was passed into law by Governor Inslee. This bill works to protect child's privacy and public records requests. I worked very closely with the City of Fife in passing this legislation. I had Fife's Mayor, City Manager, and City Clerk at the bill signing with me. My second bill, House Bill 1316, which protects vulnerable adults in the domestic violence statute, passed off the Senate floor once again, this time with its original title. This bill will be heading to the governor's desk to be signed into law in the next 20 days. I was honored this week to have a page, Anna Hoganson from Callis Junior High, join me here in the Capitol. Anna is a leadership student and active in volleyball. She has been here at the Capitol learning about the legislative process, getting to know young people from across the state, and helping legislators here on the House floor. Also, my family was here this week. I had the opportunity to introduce my mom, Tina, and my sister, Christina, to caucus, and we took pictures on the House floor. As you may have heard, Governor Inslee called for a special session starting mid-next week. The budget negotiations have stalled, surrounding a disagreement over $1.5 billion in increased taxes. We have $3 billion of increased revenue in the 2015-2017 biennium, and I believe that we can live within our means within this additional revenue. Myself and the House Republican Caucus have signed a resolution that states that we want to be back to work here in the legislature on Monday. It's important that we get our job done. Please feel free to send me an email or give me a call with your perspective. It's an honor to serve you here in the House of Representatives. Thank you.